Hello, this is Sal. In this video, we will be talking about the BGP configuration. We have this network consisting of four routers, router one, router two, three and four. I will run the command show up the interface brief on router one. And showing us here on router one that a gigabit Ethernet 000 with this IP address and a loopback 0 with this IP address and both ports are up and up and the same goes with router 2 enable show IP interface brief it's showing us here on the gigabit Ethernet 000 on the side it is connected it's configured with this IP address and on the other side on the gig, gig, gigabit Ethernet 001 with this IP address and a loop back. Now let's run this command show IP protocol and showing us no protocol enabled yet on the network. So let's start with uh, router 1 and start configuring router 1 with BGP configuration. Configure terminal, router, BGP, and here we need to assign an autonomous system number. And in this example, I'm choosing autonomous system 65001. Now, with BGP, we need to specify our neighbor and the remote autonomous system of the neighbor. It won't be done automatically, just like the other uh, protocols. Neighbor. And in this case, for router 1, the neighbor is router 2. With this interface, it flows to router 1 with 10.1.1.2. .1 .1 in that one that one the two and this router is with the autonomous system the number six five zero zero two so we type in remote autonomous system and enter the autonomous system of router number two now it's time to advertise our network network First, let's start with the loop pack with the IP address 1.1.1.1 and the submit mask. But in this case, we need to forget to put the word mask before we enter the submit mask for the IP address. In this case, it's 255. The 255.255.255 and then enter. Now, let's enter the IP address of the other network which is 10.1.1.0 and once again not to forget to put the word mask with the subnet mask 255.255.255.0 so now we connected router 1 to router 2 and let's do on this command Show IP protocol is showing us that the address uh, routing protocol we are using, which is uh, for router one with the BGP autonomous system 65001, and the address of the neighbor and the maximum path one routing information and now let's move to router number two and do the same configure terminal router bgp and the autonomous system number of num router number two which is six five zero zero two now we want to connect in this case, for 
router number two with the neighbor router number one and the same with router number three so first we will connect with router one neighbor the IP address of router number one or the interface that close to router number two which is 10 dot one dot one dot one and with the remote autonomous system router one which is six five zero zero one now we can see that there is an adjacency with the neighbor router number one now let's do it with num router number three neighbor and the IP address of eight dot dot eight dot eight dot two with the remote autonomous system for the router number three of six five zero zero three enter. Now it's time to advertise the networks or network uh, the IP addresses of the networks on router number two network ten dot one dot one dot zero and not to forget again to enter the word mask and then type in the subject mask for this network and we want to enter the, the IP address of the loop pack 2.2.2.2 with uh, not to forget again the word mask and with the subnet mask 255.255.255.255 and for the other network which is 8.8.8.2 .8 .8 .8 .8 the word mask again with the subnet mask 255.255.255.0 now let us run this command show IP VDP it's showing us in this command that we have the network loop pack of router number one and this is we run this command on router number two showing us that the next hop from router number two to router number one to read the loop back is this IP address on 10.1.1.1 and it is advertising because this is uh, the loop back on router number two there is no hops it, it advertising it internally